Ashley Judd has recently opened up about the painful memory of her mother, Naomi Judd's tragic suicide. In a heartfelt appearance on the Wednesday episode of CNN's Asterisk, All There Is With Anderson Cooper Asterisk, Ashley shared her harrowing experience of discovering her mother's body after she took her own life on April 30, 2022, at the age of 76. Reflecting on the profound trauma and shock of that day, Ashley said, It was traumatic and unexpected because it was death by suicide and I found her. But I was so glad I was there for her after her death. Her words capture the complex mix of grief, trauma, and a bittersweet sense of closeness in being present during such a pivotal moment. Ashley detailed the circumstances surrounding her mother's passing, expressing the deep love and connection she felt, even in the midst of unimaginable pain. She explained how her mother's battle with mental illness had been a profound struggle, one that Naomi had fought with immense bravery and resilience. Despite the difficulties, Ashley emphasized the importance of acknowledging and addressing mental health issues openly, underscoring how her family's ordeal has shed light on the urgent need for greater awareness and support. In recounting the moments following her mother's death, Ashley described the overwhelming wave of emotions she experienced. Finding her was one of the most devastating moments of my life, but I also felt a profound sense of responsibility and love. I wanted to be there for her, even after she had passed, to honor her and to be present in her final moments. Ashley's openness about such a personal and painful experience reflects her commitment to mental health advocacy, a cause she has embraced wholeheartedly in the wake of her mother's death. She hopes that by sharing her story, she can help others who are struggling with similar issues or who have lost loved ones to suicide. During the interview, Ashley also highlighted the legacy of her mother, not only as a celebrated country music star, but as a person who faced her battles with courage. My mother was a brilliant and talented woman who brought joy to so many through her music. Yet she also faced profound challenges. Her life was a testament to the fact that even those who seem to have it all can be struggling beneath the surface. Ashley's candid discussion with Anderson Cooper aimed to break down the stigma surrounding mental health and suicide. She stressed the importance of reaching out for help and supporting one another through difficult times. We need to create a world where people feel safe and supported in seeking help for their mental health issues. No one should have to go through this alone. As Ashley continues to navigate her grief, she remains committed to honoring her mother's memory by advocating for mental health awareness. Her strength and vulnerability serve as an inspiration, reminding us all of the importance of compassion, understanding, and support in the face of mental health struggles. Ashley revealed the raw, emotional response she had upon finding her mother. Even when I walked in that room and saw that she had harmed herself, the first thing out of my mouth was, Mama, I see how much you've been suffering, and it is okay. I am here, and it is okay to let go, she shared. Her immediate reaction was one of profound empathy and love, acknowledging the immense pain her mother had been enduring. In a poignant and compassionate gesture, Ashley spoke to her mother's spirit, urging her to find peace and reunite with their late loved ones. All was forgiven long ago, leave it all here. Take nothing, be free, she recalled saying, emphasizing the importance of letting go of past burdens and embracing freedom. During the interview, Anderson Cooper posed a reflective question, asking if Naomi's suicide had caused Ashley to question how well she truly knew her mother. Ashley responded with grace and insight. I really honor the place in you that's coming from. She continued, highlighting a broader perspective on life and death. I think we all deserve to be remembered for how we lived, and how we died is simply part of a bigger story. Ashley's words underscore the complexity of understanding and accepting the multifaceted nature of a loved one's life and struggles. She emphasized the significance of remembering her mother for the vibrant and talented person she was, rather than solely focusing on the circumstances of her death. Throughout the interview, Ashley reiterated the importance of mental health awareness and the need to support those struggling with mental illness. 
Her candid reflections serve as a powerful reminder of the profound impact of compassion and understanding in the face of such devastation has been marked by a commitment to advocacy, using her platform to shed light on mental health issues and the importance of seeking help. By sharing her story, she hopes to encourage others to speak openly about their struggles and to reach out for support. Her narrative is one of resilience and hope, demonstrating that even in the darkest moments, there can be a path toward healing and understanding. Ashley's strength in recounting her experience offers solace and inspiration to many, showing that it is possible to find peace and honor a loved one's memory, even amid profound sorrow. As Ashley Judd continues to navigate her grief, she remains dedicated to her mother's legacy, advocating for mental health awareness and support. Her story is a testament to the enduring power of love and the importance of addressing mental health with compassion and empathy. Through her vulnerability and courage, Ashley provides a beacon of hope, reminding us all of the critical need to support one another in times of need. Naomi Judd, Warned Diana Ellen Judd on January 11, 1946, in Ashland, Kentucky, rose to fame as one half of the iconic country music duo The Judds. Her life story is a tapestry woven with triumphs, trials, and an indomitable spirit that left an enduring mark on the music industry and her fans. Early Life and Struggles Naomi's early life was marked by hardship. She became a mother at 18 when her daughter, Wynonna Judd, was born in 1964. The young mother faced numerous challenges, including financial difficulties and a tumultuous marriage. After divorcing her first husband, Naomi moved to California with her daughters, Wynonna and Ashley, in search of a better life. Formation of the Judds, Naomi and Wynonna's musical journey began in earnest when they formed the Judds in the early 1980s. The duo's blend of harmonious vocals and heartfelt lyrics quickly captured the hearts of country music fans. Their debut EP, Wynonna and Naomi, released in 1983, set the stage for their subsequent success. The Judds became known for hits like Mama He's Crazy, Why Not Me, and Grandpa, Tell Me About the Good Old Days. Rise to Fame The Judds' rise to fame was meteoric. They won multiple Grammy Awards, including best country performance by a duo or group with vocal. Their music resonated with a broad audience, earning them a devoted fan base and numerous accolades. The duo's success was not just due to their musical talents, but also their genuine connection with fans and their compelling personal story of overcoming adversity. Health Challenges and Retirement In 1991, at the height of their career, Naomi was diagnosed with hepatitis C, a diagnosis that she publicly revealed in 1992. The illness forced her into early retirement from performing, and the Judds disbanded. Naomi's battle with the disease was both physically and emotionally taxing, but she faced it with resilience. She became an advocate for hepatitis C awareness, using her platform to educate others about the illness. Life After Music after retiring from music, Naomi continued to impact the public through various endeavors. She became a motivational speaker, sharing her story of resilience and hope. Her autobiography, Love Can Build a Bridge, co-written with Wynonna, detailed her life struggles and triumphs, further endearing her to fans. Relationship with her daughters Naomi's relationship with her daughters, Wynonna and Ashley, was both close and complex. Wynonna and Naomi's professional partnership brought them together in ways few mother-daughter pairs experience. However, their relationship had its challenges, marked by the usual tensions that can arise in close familial bonds. Naomi's relationship with Ashley, who pursued a successful acting career, was also deeply loving but not without its struggles. Despite the ups and downs, Naomi's love for her daughters remained a central part of her life. Mental Health Struggles Naomi's life was also marked by struggles with mental health. She openly discussed her battles with severe depression and anxiety, which were exacerbated by her chronic hepatitis C condition. Naomi's candidness about her mental health issues was groundbreaking, 
and help to reduce the stigma associated with such conditions. Later Years and Legacy In her later years, Naomi remained active in various causes and continued to make occasional public appearances. She participated in reality TV shows and reunited with Wynonna for special performances, including a farewell tour in 2010, which was celebrated by fans old and new. Tragic End on April 30, 2022, Naomi Judd tragically took her own life, a devastating event that shook her family and fans worldwide. Her passing underscored the profound impact of mental health struggles, even for those who appear to have triumphed over life's challenges. Naomi's death was a heartbreaking reminder of the importance of mental health awareness and support.